Those who shout the loudest aren't guaranteed to be heard. Are you quick to share knowledge? Or would you rather keep your advice to yourself unless you're getting paid? This weekend, I spotted a post on one of the well-known Facebook groups. A lady had, uh, had asked for some information um, as to how to you know, design a website, how to get a website up and running. The group was in a frenzy. Comments coming from left, right and centre. We're the best we can build your website. We can SEO it, optimise it, search engine optimise it. All those wonderful things. Um, another one was telling me about the national company and they did projects for all kinds of big, booming companies. Um, if you're part of any Facebook groups, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. You know, They get quite noisy, don't they? So after they've done all this, um, after there's about 30 comments, she then actually said that, you know, I've got, I've got a limited budget. My God, this group turned on her quicker than a great white shark smelling fresh blood. Her, we don't work for free. That was one of the comments. Uh, there's another one where a lady chastised her for even asking the question, you know, about web design. So what I did, I actually responded. Firstly, I congratulated her on starting her online journey and building a first bit of online foundation. I then explained to her that she could get a website for free from Wix or Weebly, but I also made sure I explained the difference between having a free website and having a paid website. That's really important. This morning, I had a message from her. She wanted to know more about the website. She also wanted to know what else me and my company did. Because her limited budget of £2,000, as nobody bothered to ask her the question what her limited budget was. She wants to put that towards making sure her business starts in the right way. And her website was just part of that. So, the moral of the story, those who shout the loudest don't necessarily get heard. You see, prospects, leads, people are analysing the answers that they get back from you. If your answers aren't nice, cohesive, why are they going to use you? So that's me, another new client, just by sharing knowledge. So share knowledge, man. Be a helper, not a shiter. I'm out of here.